was won. Well, teachers staked out of the state house in Columbia by the hundreds. The red clad educators even spilled into overflow rooms and they couldn't miss tonight. The bill that is before us today is a bill in the making. Teachers, students and parents hope to make that 84 page sweeping education reform bill better. Unfortunately, I believe a lot of the frustrations you'll hear this afternoon could have been avoided if teacher voice had been better included from the start of this process. We heard a lot of frustration tonight. There are a couple of things in here that that caused me some concern over low pay. We must be willing to pay all of our teachers not just a livable wage, wage, but a competitive wage. Over too much testing. I hear you. Yes. But whether you add another inch of a test or not, or another page or another dot, You're testing it's excessive. Much. And not being included when lawmakers so first crafted the bill. This decision has led to some fundamental and dangerous flaws in the legislation. The issues have sparked a teacher shortage. Officials say South Carolina schools started the year 600 teachers short. I believe the legislation before you it would be largely ineffective and potentially even harmful in addressing that crisis. The bill calls for more accountability in the form of another oversight committee and an education czar to run it. Former Pickens County School Board member Alex Seda says it's too much. They want to teach in the classroom freely and teach their children as they see fit. Uh, unfortunately, that freedom is being grinded out of the classroom by top-down bureaucrats. Many called for a 10% pay increase for educators and protecting teachers' rights in the classroom. And teachers say they're pleased the legislature is finally taking on an education system critically in need of reform. Lawmakers made clear tonight this bill is not final. Spartanburg Representative Rita Allison said they will shape and mold the bill with input from teachers, students, and parents. Any changes would most likely begin next year. Michael. Thanks.